Okay, to create a survey in Brightspace, we're going to go up to the activities. Click on activities, select surveys. We're going to go ahead and click new survey. And we're going to call this one mid-semester feedback. All right, I'm not going to worry about categories. Uh, it should also be noted that using the surveys is very similar to using the quiz tool. There are a few differences here. For example, anonymous. You can make the results anonymous. And once you select this, you cannot go back and change it once you publish the survey. Okay, so it is truly anonymous and you won't be able to track who said what. All right. We're going to add a question, and this is the other feature that is a little different than the quiz tool. We have Likert questions available. So if I click on New, Questions, Likert, Title is optional, and here I'm going to ask them to um, rate the different class room activities. Okay. And scroll down. I'm going to put it on a scale 1 to 10. You can choose however you want to. Here I'm going to ask them about homework. Tests. And you can continue adding different ones if you want. All right. So I got the question created. I'm going to hit save. And Right now, we're just going to do one question. You can add more questions later if you want. All right. So we go back. This takes us to the properties page. And as you can see, right here is the one question that we um, set up. So if I click on that, here's the preview of what it's going to look like. I got their question introduction there, and then I got the different activities that I wanted them to rate. Okay. All right. So scrolling down. I'm going to go into restrictions. Now when you look here, just like in the quiz tool, it automatically defaults to inactive. I'm going to make it active. I'm going to give it a start date here. And also, I probably want to end this, give the students uh, some time to complete it. I'm going to display it in the calendar. Um, attempts, I'm going to give them a single attempt that is editable until the end date. Okay. Then if you have somebody that's uh, not able to complete the uh, survey within that time frame, you can give them special access. And we can talk about that a little later as well. Okay. Uh, I'm not going to worry about the other two tabs up here right now. Save and close. And right here is our survey. So let's uh, take a look and see what it looks like. All right. The survey is anonymous, so it does tell the students that they're identity will remain anonymous and they can go ahead and take it submit the, save their responses and then submit the survey yep now remember we did submit this to editable so they can come back in anytime between the start date and the end date in order to make changes all right if you have any further questions about the survey tool please contact Caleb or I we're in the basement of Cowan Hall in room 110. Thank you.